Hi, this is James P. Madonna of Mega Life 21. I am here at the Chori Pan Rodicio on Main Street in Hackensack, New Jersey. Uh, I'm here with my good friend and premier personal trainer and nutritional consultant to the stars, Mr. Mario Petrus, She's an MMA one, fighter. This one. She's my next one. Oh, who are you talking about? See, see where it is? The beginning of Main Street in Heck. She's going to be your next uh, cu client, customer? Yeah, this is my next one. Gordo? Right. We're here at uh, Ch uh, Chori, Chori, Chori Pond, Pond. the Rodizio in uh, Hackensack. All you can eat meat. I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to devour some uh, flesh today for all you vegans out there. I'm going to try to eat about four pounds of flesh. I'm going to try to eat a little animal. We're, we're doing this in, little animal. We're doing this in honor of all the vegetarians yeah. and vegans out there that do not eat meat. We're going to eat we're enough gonna meat. I'm going to try to eat a little animal today. Okay. Yeah. Equivalent of a little bear. <laughs> a little All right. bear. All right. <laughs> All right. Okay, we're gonna. This is a very nice place. Uh, nice and cozy, and, and this uh, traditional rodizio barbecue rotisserie. Uh, and uh, we're gonna sit here. Yeah. I wanna hide myself. Just kidding. You're gonna hide yourself? Just kidding. Wow. Now the only you can eat, now I can do anything I want. What actually are like for lunch, 12 different meals. I think it's very nice, man. Yeah. Yeah, whatever they, they have for lunch. And as you can see, this is a real old-fashioned wood-burning rotisserie. So you get you get the wonderful flavor of the smoke in the meat. Who can they bring it to Two sides. You can eat or you can and so now I can eat anything here too? No, it's, you know, the meat already is chicken barbecue, uh, beef kebab, short ribs, and uh, pork ribs for loin. Chirasco? It's, yeah, chirasco, all you can take it. Uh, yeah, bring a lot of that chirasco. What, what's your name, sir? Rafael. Rafael, nice to meet you. And uh, this is going to be on the internet, on YouTube. So uh, I'll, I'll put the uh, the name of the restaurant. And you can look at it and see okay. yourself as Rafael. Okay. All right. Just want to show everybody the the, the rodicio. There it is. There's, get a close up. There we go. Bending around, the, the wonderful flavor from the smoke, from uh, the smoke from the wood, is naturally flavoring the meat. And all you vegetarians and you vegans out there, you know you don't like it. It's too bad. Screw you. Screw every one of you. Look at this beautiful uh, steak knife, gigantic for brontosaurus dinosaur steaks. The hell with you vegans. All right. You want to be on YouTube? Oh, what's your name, sir? Carlos. Oh, it's nice to meet. Nice to meet you. What do we got? Oh, does it? Oh, they're talking about the World Series. I like the brick. See those bricks? Those are perfect for smashing the heads right through. Cranberry or snapple or ice cream? Uh, cranberry. Cranberry? Yeah. Yeah, those those are perfect. The walls, you see the walls, the brick? Perfect. Yes, I, I love perfect. the I love the rustic look. I always like bricks. Beautiful stuff. I like castle. What's up, buddy? I like castle Looks stone. Like Not too much. Rare. I like rare. I like blood. <laughs> All right? Blood. He's a vampiro. A lot of blood. The Churrasco, a lot of blood. Make sure it's bleeding. <laughs> All right? Thank you. <laughs> Make sure it's on the rag. Alright, hey Kenny Thiessen, I still didn't get my t-shirt. I'm waiting for it. No, he'll, he'll send it. He, right. He's a very busy man. He, he writes yeah. programs for a lot of clients. Yeah, yeah, I know he does, but still, you know what I'm saying? I, I, you know, I do the same thing. But I'm here in the oh, buffet. I know I got my t-shirt. I'm very happy with it. I just want to say yes. I want to give a shout out to Ken Thiessen, the uh, former WWE star and uh, competitive bodybuilder and grappler. Um, and uh, right now he's in Boca Raton, Florida, writing uh, many programs for many clients. And uh, he specializes also in alternative strength training. Um, Ken, this is beautiful. Putting the heads right through. Beautiful. Yeah. Very good for putting heads through the wall. All right. 
I, they like, give like you two this. sides. You got a choice of two sides. They'll tell you. I got the rice and two beans sides. and the sweet potato fries. Now, is it possible to, as a side dish, to have a, a barbecued obliques of an animal? Because it's a side. Get it? Oh, yeah, a side. I know what you know, the oblique is, my balls. For, for you people out there that don't know what an oblique is, it's, it's the muscles on the side of your abdomen. And uh, I was thinking if I can have a, a, a low-carb, high-protein side dish, which would oh, be yeah, a barbecued my, uh, obliques. This is my buddy, uh, Nick Belmonte. You mean the yeah, the, the, the Monte yeah, Tomato? He designs, he designs websites, flyers. He's uh, he's great at what he does. I mean, uh, very you know, good. I actually added him to the groups today. Ah, to the list oh yes, the, the Facebook and, group. Uh, I added him to yeah. uh, everything is food. Oh, let me let me uh, uh, also plug everything is food. Our our very large, uh, ever growing Facebook group. Well, so far I think we're closing in, closing in on. Um, Almost, uh, almost 700 right now. Almost. Well, holistic is a lot. 1,300. Holistic Health Talk is yeah. the, is the largest. Uh, 1,300 uh, members. It's growing rapidly. And it's growing very rapidly. Oh, wait a minute. Where is it? Oh, you pour the whole bottle? Yeah. Oh, all right. Thank you. Make sure you don't leave any drops. All right. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Mario Petrus is uh, having his. Uh, what is it, cranberry iced tea? Yeah, cranberry. All right, enough, enough, enough. I'm enough, hideous. enough, enough. I'm so, what do you think of the ob uh, what do you think of the barbecued rotisserie obliques to have as a side dish? Actually, I'm going to ask him right now because it's a side. Pig. Cut the pig right on the side. <laughs> uh, Main Street in Hackensack, New Jersey. I'm just showing you around the establishment. They got the, the hookah paradises over there, smoke shop. Make sure you get to the nostrils. Mario Petrus. I don't want to aggravate him too much. <laughs> oh, me arse. All right, here with James P. Madonna. Oh, uh, actually just water with lemon. But, but uh, you said something about side dish? Yeah, the uh, rice and beans, much potato. Oh, sweet potato fries? Um, you know what? That sounds good. Sweet potato You have two choices. You have another choice. Oh, I do have two sweet, choices. Sweet potato fries and what else? Sweet potato fries and uh, rice and beans. Are you going to have the rodeo too? Oh, yeah. I'm going to have the same rodeo. Okay. Sweet potato fries and rice and beans. Right, and rice and beans. Or, Thank you, boss. Or, or beans and rice, either way. Yeah, yeah. Make it beans and rice, not rice and beans. All right. All right. <laughs> it's less, less carbohydrates with beans and rice. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> anyway, it's me, James P. McDonald of Mega Life 21, and I'm here. Just, this is to prove that I'm not just the voice in the background, that I'm really here with Mario Petrus. Is my hair okay? Should I stop filming? Yeah. Just gave me a loaf. They just gave me a small loaf of bread over here. You know what I'm saying, hey, what's up, Jew? How you doing? I like Jewish people. Hey, what are you doing, buddy? Did they play? The, did they have that opera last night? Did they do it? You know, it's freedom of speech. What opera? The opera in New York uh, about that guy, the, the the handicapped guy in the wheelchair that was murdered by Palestinians. Uh, supposedly it was. Uh, oh wow, beautiful. Supposedly the. Because the, the play, you know, makes it look like the Palestinians were heroes, but in reality, the, the, all the Jews are saying. You mean on on, on the, uh, the the Medita Medita on the cruise Apple. ship? Yeah, on the cruise ship. They made they made a. The Jews made a stink. They tried to protest in. Uh, in Wait, you're talking about you're talking about this. This happened many years ago. Eighty five. The Achille Loro, the uh, I think it was called the is Italian cruise ship in the Mediterranean. Sure, I'm not sure. You're talking yes. about the Klinghoffer? Kling, yes, yes. Klinghoffer? Yes. The man, the father. Well, did you hear about the opera they were having last night? No. They were having a, uh, they were having a show, and, and it was portraying the the Palestinians as heroes. You know what I'm 
right. heroes for throwing the man in a wheelchair overboard? Well, we don't know the whole story, you know, so you can't really judge the situation or... I don't know. Say anything about I don't know if he taunts. I don't that, know. That, that we're going to have to leave out of the video. Yeah. Goddamn Jews. All right. Now, <laughs> now, we got a loaf of bread over here. I'm not going to touch it all. Are you going to fill yourself? All right. It's a little, little white bread, but this is like a home. Is it warm? Like a homemade. Yeah, it's nice. I'm actually going to have a nice little Yeah, piece. I'll, have, I'll have one slice. Because I, I know what they're doing. They, they want us to fill up. But they, don't, they don't realize I'm going to eat a small little animal today. You know? <laughs> The equivalent of a small and we're bear. doing it in honor of all the vegans and vegetarians yeah. in the world. Yeah, vegans, this is for you. Look at the skewers of meat coming. Here they come. Oh, here we go. Boy. Hello, my friend. How are you? All Chorizo? Right. Now, this is okay. Chorizo and chicken. Uh, uh, I'll take uh, uh, I'll take one of each. One each. One each. Ah, oh, boy. Did you say? Yeah, one each. The churrasco is cooking, right? Excuse me, this is the not coming with a, a scarce steak. This is a special coming with a chiriaki, uh, red sauces, chiriaki chicken, spicy chicken, silo and sauce steak, beef, beef kebab, a uh, turkey with bacon and pork. That's it. Oh, the, he told that, me. No, the, <coughs> the scarce steak is for dinner, dinner, right? And picanha is a different price, $30. Yeah, but you want told, that, the told, second one? He told me it was the came with everything. No, no, the skirt. If it doesn't come with everything, then I'm not going to stay. I'm sorry, sir. This yeah. is $15, dollars so do not come in the skirt steak. What See, the skirt, skirt steak comes with the dinner. Yes. Yeah. Uh, you want the regular? $30, no problem. No, he told me before I sit down, $15, get any meat we want. That's what he told me. Yeah, don't worry about it. I am worried about it. I'm not gonna pay extra 15 each. No, for, no. You know, say if no. you would have said 30 each, I would have stayed. I wouldn't have stayed for 30 each. I would, no. I would rather go over there. Yeah. Greek Island. Yeah. I know with uh, with the other place, they did the same thing. They had certain meat for lunch, and then they had certain meats for dinner. I mean, the other one. They used to be around Excuse me. Greenfield. Excuse me. Yeah, um, you told me I get everything, churrasco. Yeah, it's, well, it's like at Silo uh, State with garlic. That's not churrasco. No, I'm sorry, yeah, it is, uh, yeah, but they call churrasco. It's a Silo State with oh. garlic. Now, what else? Where's that guy? Excuse me. Pork ribs. What else do we get? We get short ribs. Short, short ribs? With bacon. Excuse me. We get, we get short ribs. The special, the special, the lunch. Got it. Red sauces. Chiriaki chicken. Spicy chicken. Silo and sauce steak. Uh -huh. Turkey with bacon uh -huh. and pork. You just call me short ribs. Short ribs. Short ribs. No? Oh, I know that one. Uh, I, I, I can't stay here. Because I, I would, if you would have told me from the beginning, I would have said no. You know? I'm sorry. I can't. I can't. Okay. All right. Do you okay. want to stay? I don't know. No. Well, you're the boss. I mean, I can't stay here. I, I, you know, I like coming here for chicken, and so I came here for steak. And if you would have yeah, said, if you would have said, said, if you would have, if you would have said, shh, shh, no, talking to him. Sir. He's okay. the one who told me. You didn't tell me nothing. Okay. If you would have told me that, I would have stayed. I can't do it. All right, guys. Thank you. Uh, I'm sorry. Domingo. Okay. Oh. Okay, we have our waiter here, Domingo. Uh, let me just have, uh, yeah, the best waiter in New Jersey, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, we are here at the Port of Call Fine Restaurant and Buffet in Hackensack, New Jersey, on, uh, what is this? Uh, 450 Hackensack Avenue. 450 Hackensack Avenue, Hackensack, New Jersey, and I will have ice water with lemon. You got it, boss. We're All right. right back with that. And here we have beautiful Port, port of Call. Hey, this, is much, this is much better. You're gonna love this one. Beautiful flower arrangement. All right, now James, this is beautiful buffet. They have all sorts of sushi. They got everything. Same price as the other one, okay? And the other one, they wanted me to pay 15 something bucks for little chicken thighs, a little bit of a sausage, and, and uh, some sirloin. 
What are they nuts? If I wanted, if I wanted that, I would go outside and get some squirrels. I'll eat some squirrels. What are you nuts? Come in here. Look, look what yeah. I'm eating here. Oh, the squirrels are eating nuts right now. I'll go get three or four squirrels. Same thing. Here, look. You know what I'm saying? That's his first plate. I'm gonna uh, go up and get mine. Go. Oh, that's beautiful, hey, man. Wait till you see that. the sushi they have. Look at that. It's unbelievable. Uh, gotta love it. How are you? How you doing? Good. All right, good. High quality. Okay, port of call. I'm gonna get up now. Now this is gonna be a good buffet. Yes, James, same price. Really? What's better? Oh, this place by a blows it away. Oh, definitely blows away that that uh, blows it that away. jabroni. Uh, uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna eat four small animals here. Four. That that jabroni rodizio we were at. Hold on, hold on. Start again. This sushi, four star sushi. Four Look star that. sushi. Look at that. Wow, look at that. Look at that, look at that hunk. You understand? Art artistic. I'm gonna go, go get my plate and uh, try to get some of uh, the churrasco, I mean the, the beef, hopefully rare, at the carving station. Yeah. Right? Wow, look at that. That sushi bar. Excellent. I guess this is, uh, it's like tuna, sashimi. Over here we got some, uh, you know I like mackerel. Mackerel sashimi. I guess this might be, uh, I don't know. Tuna. White tuna and salmon. Fish roll, bright red, fish eggs, what's that? These are all the rolls for people that can't eat, that don't want raw food.
Yeah, I, I can't. I can't carry the meat. I can't carry the meat. Let me tell you something. Did you go get the meat? He brought it to me. Hey, this, now this buffet, I'm going to be hitting this all the time. Nothing beats this. this so this is, bucks. this so far, this is number one, number one for quality and value for the money. Bang for the number buck. One. There's nothing even comes close. So far in northern New Jersey. Not even the $7. Not even. Not I mean, even just the, look, at, look at the, I mean. Look yeah. at that. Not even the flaming grill. This you, is for all I you think vegans. you're right. This is for all you vegans out there. See this? This is, this is equivalent to my little bird. Today I'm gonna eat about four little little bears. My four little bears today. All right, now look at this. I'm eating my churrasco. Rare. Actually, it's a little more than rare. And over here we got. Look at this assortment of sushi. Look at the tuna in there. Look at the size of that. You're never gonna get another sushi place that gives you this for fifteen dollars. All you can eat. Tuna rolls. Look at that. Work of art. Work of art. Look at that. Beautiful. It's exploding in, my, in your mouth. Okay, we're at the Port of Call Cafe in Hackensack, New Jersey. Outstanding value, outstanding quality food. Uh, let's see what they got here. White tuna. Um, I'm not sure what this is. And this is it's like calamari and shrimp marinated. Calamari, shrimp, and, and uh, scallops, like uh, calico scallops, baby scallops. Yeah, calico scallops, the small ones. Oh, and mussels too, there's mussels in here. Tomato seafood mix, white wine. Saute cabbage. Some kind of sausage, I'm not sure what that is. I'll try one. Jack Daniels chicken. Fried calamari, fried calamari. It's a um, flounder fillet. Roast beef. Nah, you know what? Here we got. Looks like Dungeness or Jonah crabs. Jonah crabs. Too much work for me. I'm honest with you. Salad. They look, look like New Zealand green lip mussels. Uh, and some grilled items. Chicken teriyaki, but I'm gonna try a couple barbecued ribs. I'm gonna come back to the carving station. Okay, we got some side dishes here. Spinach or gratin, macaroni and cheese. As the carving station. Big place though. It's a salad, bar, dessert. Yeah, 
I guess it'll take up. I sir, they have some uh, red, yeah, the rare stuff. That should do it. Two of those. What else? What else? What's that? What's that? Shell steak? This is sirloin. Sirloin? Um, yeah, I'll take a half of that. Thank you. Oh boy, looks good. Okay, round two. Oh wow. I got the seafood salad, a couple ribs, and, and some ri two slices of rare roast beef. Uh, I gotta go get a giant steak knife. Alright, um, now this, this is fatty salmon. This is the first time I've had this. Look at that. Look at that, look at that, look at that piece of salmon on top. Wow. Unbelievable. Most likely very rich in omega-3 fatty acids. color, I mean, just look at this. Omega-3 fatty acids. It just melts in your mouth, you know what I'm saying? Better than a little squirrel, you know? Alright. How's it taste? Awesome. Look at this plate. Look at all the meat and the sushi. Look at the sushi roll. Salmon, tuna, avocado, cucumber. Look at all that meat in there. Look at these. Look at that. Look at that right there. Beautiful pieces of sushi. Very this is the fatty salmon. Yes, uh, I'm gonna try that a little bit. But uh, I just got some, probably, maybe uh, one of my favorite uh, meats of all time. Uh, one of my favorite. I got a piece of skirt steak. Love it. Very tender. Outstanding piece of meat. They got some more coming off the grill shortly. So I'll be sure to get more. Okay, I'm going to try to get some uh, fatty salmon. Let's see. I guess that's it. Yellow too? I think so. Yeah. Yeah, it's good quality. Yeah. You know, from around here. Yeah, I'm from the area. We, me and my friend do an internet talk show when we uh, we're filming different. We go to different buffets and restaurants. Um, yeah, well, mainly I do political shows, but I we, this is like a break. Yeah. All right, thank you. Okay. All right, I guess I'll take one of these fish rows. At the, the Porta Call, Porta Call Buffet Restaurant in Hackensack, New Jersey. Porta Call. Some. Wasabi. Uh, a little more. Very hot, but I just want to make sure I have enough. Pickled ginger is all very good for you. Fermented medicinal appetizer. Condiment. Beautiful place, really great value. Very fresh seafood, sushi. I guess uh, I had enough mackerel. Let's see what we got over here. Over here's fruit, dessert. Uh, ah. Let's 
about it. I had enough red meat. Ah, look at this rub. I think I had it before. Take one of these. Nice bright red fish roll. All right, go back. Next is dessert. So you think you're gonna elevate your oxygen levels with that? Huh? Yeah, sure. Are you gonna contribute to the molecular structure of what you are with that? What do you think? Yes, my yeah. mito my mitochondria yeah. is going to be very saturated with Beautiful. something. I don't know about oxygen, but it's, it'll be saturated. Beautiful. Okay, we're here with Domingo at the uh, Port of Call Buffet uh, restaurant. Me and Mario over here. What's up? What are you doing over there? We were, we, were talk, we were talking about like the English language. Okay. It's very difficult to learn English because it's very confusing language. What's with all these silent letters? You know, like I walk through the door. T-H-O-U-G-H. Why do you need a G-H? I mean, you, you don't pronounce it. What do you need the K in front of the knife for? Right, it's supposed to be, is it knight? No, yeah, it's night. <laughs> night, well, you have day and night, but this is the nights at the round table. K-N, or what about the, the insect? Gnat, it's gnat, right? G-N-A-T. You know, I always wonder, what, 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 do, what do gnats eat anyway? They, they bug you, but they don't bite. Yeah, that's crazy, right? They, I think they live off the sweat. They, they, they eat sweat? The neck. They get all the sweat. So, <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah, they, they, uh, it's like, uh, yeah, it's they like a... They extract all the nutrients. Out of that. Like the moth man, I mean the moth. So anyway, it, it, it's 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 yeah, very complicated. Them. Okay. Very complicated language with all these these uh, silent letters. Complicated. You want to hear complicated? Go ask Dominicans how they came up with that language that they have. That's complicated. Oh, too. speaking of Dominicans, yeah. how come on let's say on Facebook every Dominican girl? Okay. With, uh, with the profile, has a very different name than all the other Latin yeah, we're, countries. Yeah, that's one thing I agree We're pretty unique when it comes to The names are... With these names, I don't know where they come up with. The names I never heard of. They, they, nobody in Latin America uses these first names. Like Belkis. You know? Like Belkis. Have you ever perfect, heard of Belkis? Yeah. Perfect what? example. My cousin's name. Yeah. Janitza. What is it? Janitza. I've heard that. Janitza? That is, that's what I'm saying, but it's not something you hear every day. You don't go in like, into a classroom and hear that yeah. name every day. You see what I'm saying? Right. And if you talk to other uh, uh, Latin people from other countries, they don't. They, you never heard of a Janitza? No. You don't, you don't hear those names. But the guys have normal, regular names. Sometimes. The Dominican men. Sometimes. Sometimes? Sometimes. Like Joel. Or you get, for example, you'll get the normal names, they'll just, they're not spelled right. Like, for example, the, the picture from the Mets, Henry Mejia, it's spelled J E N two R's and a Y. Really? Yeah. It's supposed to be Henry, but they put they spelled Henry with a J. Well, that's because the J is like, ha ha. Yeah, ja, ja, ja. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I, I like simple, normal names like David Ortiz. You okay, know? Manny Ramirez. Manny Ramirez, who's big, from Washington Heights, who's I think. Big yeah, big, who's, who's that big pitcher from the Yankees? The big dude? Manolo? No, the big guy. Oh, CC Sabathia? Yeah, that CC guy. Sabathia. What, is he Dominican? No. Oh, he's not? Yeah, you know what? I'm going to start saying that. I'm going to start saying CC's Dominican. What? What is he? No, he's, uh, he's from California. American. Well, he looks like he's a Dominican, right? Hey, Sabathia? You look, hey, you can pass with him. You know what? I'm going to send another dude. You should just tell everybody in the Bronx that you're yeah. Interesting. Is is uh, uh, is uh, Alex uh, Alex a Rodriguez? Yeah, A-Rod's Dominican, but well, they put, like, uh, how hey, they over there. You got quadruple layer cake? No? Quadruple layer cake. You don't have it? Yeah, oh. but it's, uh, you know, uh, uh, they have the best baseball uh, farm system, I mean, uh, in the world. Oh, yeah. The best. Dominican. Yeah, dude, forget it. Those I, guys, that's Cuba. like the one-way ticket. And right? Cuba. Yeah, and Cuba. I tell you, that, that inter those international uh, uh, playoffs, yeah. I love it. I, I, the last time I watched it, it was Korea versus Japan at the end. Okay. But, but Cuba had an outstanding team. I was surprised the Netherlands had Korea a... Korea beat these guys? No, Korea oh, was the Korea and Japan. The Maker probably won it last time. It was uh, last year. Yeah, they won it. Oh, Dominican Republic won last year? Puerto Rico. Oh, so Japan and Korea was not in the finals. They were, no, they're probably in the semi-final. I'm not sure. Yeah. But I know they did. Maybe. Yeah. Because they're always good too, man. Yeah, 
They won the first. Japan won the first. Ch Ch the Japan beat uh, Korea, but Korea was in the finals. Right one year, I, I, I watched it. Outstanding players. You know, Mexico. Yep. A lot of them were chubby. <laughs> Okay, we're here at the Porta Call Buffet. Uh, trying to decide what I'm gonna have here. Get some cake, chocolate cake. Looks like carrot cake. Uh, Jellos. I don't know what these are. Oh, what's this? What is this? I have no idea what this is. I'm gonna try it. Okay, one of those. Mario P Petrus wants a creme brulee. Alright. I know I want some ice cream. Let's see what we got here. Oh, wait a minute. Is that green tea ice cream? Is that green tea ice cream? Yes. Yeah, really? Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll take a, a, a cup. I love green tea ice cream. You like three big scoops? How many scoops? No, no, a few, a few of them. Scoops? Yeah, fill it up. I, didn't, I haven't had this in a long time. I don't know why they don't sell it in all, all the stores. Very good, green tea ice cream. Thank you. All right. That's the soft one. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Okay. All right. Okay, we're back with the great Mario Petrus. Here's your creme brulee. They have green tea ice cream. It's not. I have no idea. I know, I'm gonna try it. I don't know what it is. This is my friend. I know, it's great. Call my friend. He has a, his, his, his daddy owns a farm. His daddy owns a farm in um, Blairstown, New Jersey. Yeah. He goes hunting. He's got, he's got like, like 10 acres or something like that. He goes uh, hunting for deer. He's supposed to get me some deer meat right now. He's not answering the phone. Some venison? Yeah. His, I, name, is, his name is Jimmy. I told you I used to make venison. Venison chili? Yeah, I might have to smack him around, you know what I'm saying? Ten elbows to the nose? Yeah, he's gonna have to get ten elbows to the nose. Okay, we're here at uh, Port of Call uh, Buffet. What uh, you're cute having? Little thing, right? Cute little thing. Look at yeah, that. a little chocolate. Yeah, look it's at like that. Cute little thing. It's like a strawberry custard. Look how cute that is. Look how cute that is. Beautiful. You like it? Yeah, beautiful. It tastes great. And how was the creme? How was the creme brulee? It was good. This is this is a little better than this. Ah. Try that. Oh, excellent, excellent. Me, I just got some more uh, soft vanilla ice cream. I had green tea ice cream before here at the. Port Porta Call uh, buffet, outstanding value. You're having your coffee now. I don't. I can't see the dinner. James and Mario, can you make me a star? Uh, I want to go to Hollywood with you guys. <laughs> oh, great! That's great. Well, well tell me something. Uh, um, do do girls girls with bright pink hair? Are they usually pink all over? <laughs> You mean does the hair match the carpet? Yeah. Usually I was born like this, so. Oh wow. Yeah. <laughs> and, and you were saying you weren't sure that this was a magenta or fuchsia. No, I think it's a little no. bit of both. How do they pronounce it, fuchsia or, or fuchsia? <laughs> How does it pronounce? Probably fuchsia. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, we're here at the Porta Call. This is one of the waitresses. I don't want to call you Pinky. What's your real name? Sandy. That's your stage name? Sandrina. Oh, not Sandra. No, Sandrina. Sandrina. Yes. Oh, interesting. <laughs> interesting. What do you think? Add a girl. Add a girl. Yes. <laughs> you know he trained. You know who he trained? Who? He trained the. the I'm not lying. The cast from Jersey Licious and uh, and the Housewives of New Jersey. Really? Nah, I, I never really trained them, but <laughs> he knows them. No, he knows them. <laughs> You know I, I, them or you know no, of them? I don't, I know of them. They're clowns. <laughs> They're clowns. They couldn't shine my shoes. They're, they're like the kids that got thrown in garbage cans in high school, you know? That's them. Nah, he really knows. He really knows them. Uh, just being modest. You know what I'm saying? They're like but, the people that got thrown in garbage cans. You mean like dumpster? Uh, yeah. 
That's hilarious. That's not nice. Where's the Jersey Shore? I don't know. Yeah, those guys, those guys are the biggest clowns. Those, those guys, those guys, they, those guys will put on a show just to make fun of New Jersey. You know? No, it's true. It's all the Absolutely, and Italian. Just, just to make fun of New Jersey. You're Italian. I'm Italian. Now, I'm Italian and Greek. Italian mother, he's Greek and I'm Italian. Get out of here. See, look. Now, Italian mothers, they they usually drive you nuts. They they drive you bonkers. My, my, my mom is like off the wall and safe. She's a nervous wreck. She made me a nervous and my sister a nervous wreck. Absolutely, like a hundred percent. That's what my mom is too. When I see her go like this, I know something's going down. No, but my, mom's Greek. my mom's Italian. My hey. dad is Greek, like off the boat Greek, like like when I was young, I didn't understand anything he said. Greek? No, only all the bad words. That's it. But everything has to be done right away. Everything. If I if I if wash I say one second. Yeah. No. If I wash the dishes now as a as a guy, I'm I'm a not, I'm pretty nice washing the dishes, <laughs> and I and I scrub them very well. I'm very meticulous. I rinse them very well. There's not one no not one bubble of soap left. She wants them dried and put away. Hello. Like Hello. she'll check them Hello. and make sure it's no. I'll perfect. hear banging in the kitchen. Yeah, I says, absolutely. I says I told you I'm busy. I'll I'll get it in 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 20 minutes. That's not good enough. It's got to be put away. It's got to be dried. I says, first of all, when you dry things by towel, bacteria grows in a damn towel. Let it air dry. Let it air dry. It, it's like it, it, everything is like a, a, a life and death with them. Absolutely. My dad, too. Oh, my God. My dad is Greek. He's worse than worse He's than worse than, than oh really? Oh, my God. 100%. He got better now, but he was like off the boat Greek, like European. Yeah, Greek, Greeks are worse. Oh, my God. Crazy. You mean like being a, a, a nagging pain in the ass? Did you ever see my big fat big wedding? No, I never saw it before. Okay, you have to watch that. It's, it's like, it's like the whole thing. I swear to God, my whole life. Uh, really like now, now, Halloween is uh, next Saturday, is it? No, no, next Friday. 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 Next Friday. Yeah, my favorite time of year. Yeah. Or, uh, October. Um, yeah, that's why I have my web pages all like dark and gothic looking. Is it? Oh, what's your web page? I want to actually give a card. Uh, I don't have a card, but uh, if you Google Mega Life 21, Mega Life? you'll see my hundreds of shows. Everything will come up. Everything. You name it, it'll come up. Mega Life 21. Just, yeah, just Mega Life 21 on Google. Cool. <laughs> yeah, I mean, instead of me giving you links, you know, it's just... It'll all come That's up. cool. So what is this for? What do you guys do? Well, I... How do you say it? Um, how do you say it? Um, we're fucking clowns, you know what I'm saying? No, no. I'm just kidding. No, he's... he's <laughs> he has a program. He's got a lot of clients where people have lost hundreds of pounds. And, uh, That's, I lost 150 pounds. Wow. Well, he's got a, his system tightens up loose skin without using surgery or anything. With the cream? No. Diet. Food. Really? Everything is food. Essential fats and food. It's the only thing that's going to tighten up your skin. I was going to get surgery done, actually. If you get surgery done, you'll be screwed up forever. Because so? you know, remember, the skin's supposed to fit around you like a glove. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You get the surgery, you tighten it here and there, it's never going to be like that perfect fitting glove. Well, it's always going to be out of alignment, you know? But nobody really knows the truth. Yeah. Well, so the thing is with me is that I was, I've been on a journey. I was 320 pounds, right? And I'm five, one and a half, so I was big. And then two years ago, two and a half years ago, I lost 150 pounds because I got lap band surgery. So I got that done. And I'm, I'm a singer, songwriter. Like, I write music. I right, well, what's that other word? You, you did lap dances. Lap band. <laughs> what? Lap dances is after hours. I did lap band two years ago. Lap band? <laughs> yeah. Perfect for camera. <laughs> yeah, I know. Great attitude. I was, I did a, um, <laughs> Sorry, it was like stuff. a, it was like a reality show. We did like a pilot for that. We did it. But I was on that. I'm a, I'm a very yeah, stage you, person. Yeah, I love it. Uh, you know, very you, versatile. You, you don't let the Jews have their way with it. Absolutely why. not. <laughs> no, she, she knows. She, she, nobody's gonna pull anything over on her. I can tell. That's good. <laughs> That's how you have to be. And uh, yeah, so. Uh, yeah, I, I do a political show with somebody else, and uh, I used to work for pro wrestling. I was like a bad guy manager. Oh, cool. And I did color commentary, and now I just do the political show. 
and I'm working with him on this uh, documentary. We're just goofing around with the restaurants. We right, decided right. to be buffet critics. Honestly, we should have a show about restaurants. It's going to be fucking hilarious. You know what happened before here? It's going to be on YouTube with this. We were in the, um, Ro the Rodizio on Main Street in Hackensack. Okay, I know that is Brazilian, Ro whatever it is, Argentina. They were giving us garbage meat for lunch for the same price as it costs to come here. And he found out that the waiter lied to him and we weren't getting skirt steak and other things. We were just getting um, sirloin. For four different types of meat. And two sides. Yeah. So he so flipped out and was yelling at him. I'm gonna flip, I'm like that. Do not try to, listen, listen. If I'm gonna pay a certain price and I don't get what the hell I want, I'm gonna flip. Like I'm gonna yeah. flip out. Like it's not right. That's why honestly, like I work here, like people say whatever, but I really like yeah. this place is awesome. And the manager started like raising his voice to him and said, This is what we have for lunch, and we have this and we have this and we and he says, Shut up, I'm not talking to you, I'm talking <laughs> to your waiter. Yeah, he like went up he just went off on him. Yeah, I don't yeah. like when people try to pull one over on me. No, I, no, I would have, no. It's either you get smacks or elbows if you do that. You know? that I'm not, seriously, like, I'm a nice person. Don't push me. Yeah. Don't push me. And don't try to lie to me. Like, who do you think I am? And they don't know, like, that you know a lot about, like, the business. So they're just like, oh, listen, this is this. Uh, no, bitch, anybody, that's not anybody, that. Anybody who goes there and pays $15? And this is out on this for 15 But that's what I'm saying. You have like five different kinds of meat, then you have four different kinds of sushi, you have soups, you have salads, there's a baked section, it's, it's a bunch of different things. Then the dessert yeah. is like all homemade. No, Tarami soup, did you try Tarami soup? No, the dinner, is it that much better than the lunch? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. on weekends we have filet mignon. Believe this? We get to have filet mignon. We have oh, crab legs, white filet mignon on weekends, cheesecake, flan. We have oysters, suckling crab pig, legs. roast pig with the apple in his mouth. No, we have pork loin though. <laughs> with the apple in the, in, the, in, the, in the ass, I mean mouth. <laughs> Pork leg. But, it, but uh, anyway, getting back to Hollywood. Yes. People don't realize that the very best in any given talent is not necessarily going to go to Hollywood and be a big star. Those people are hand-picked. It's, it's very like uh, political, office politics, you know, you have uh, the cronyism, you know. Right. In other words, you, you can't say, okay, I'm proven one of the best singers around and I proved it, so no, I'm going to go matter. to Hollywood. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Let That's me tell you something. The industry now, it doesn't matter how much talent you have. If you look good and you have someone that can make you what the yeah. industry is looking for, there, like there, they have so right. many. And they have casting couches. Oh, absolutely. You see how the industry, you say the industry? Yeah. Well, it's not the industry. It's the Jew. If the Jew <laughs> well, can make you. It's gay. It's gay. If the yeah. Jew, yeah. Yeah. If the Jew can Mostly make gay. you look like what he wants to portray to the, you know, the Christian little kids in the suburbs, then, you know, to brainwash. Them and to fucking destroy their minds, yeah. then you'll be in. It's like with Jennifer Lopez, she 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 gets involved with who, whoever can help her career. Opportunist. It's true though. Yeah, you know, she was with it's Puff true. Daddy because she was uh, became a, a singer. Then she's with somebody else and Mark Anthony and this one and that one. But see, it works though. Well, because she's the type that is all career for herself. She, as long as she gets from right, point A to point B. Right now, the best singers, I think, my opinion. Is uh, that that girl, um, the white skinny girl, skinny, she's white blonde, like southern? What the hell's her name? Oh, uh, Taylor, Taylor Swift. Swift. Taylor Swift. I think she's the one of the best. I think uh, Rihanna is one of the best. Mm -hmm. And Nicki Minaj, I think, is awesome because she's just. She's Even not, yeah, she Rihanna, the only thing with Rihanna, she's stupid enough to go back to a guy that beats her up. So yeah, she's one, not even two, with him anymore. Three. She's oh. like, she's always back and forth with him. Ladies back and Lady forth, Gaga yeah. Lady Gaga's a fucking reject. Well, she was a go-go dancer, Lady Gaga, yeah. originally, yeah. So was Anna Nicole Smith when she was alive. And then she married the old 90-year-old the old geezer. Yep, and that's yeah. what got her where well, she was. one foot on the banana peel, one foot in the grave. The billionaire. She's like, I love him. I love him. <laughs> oh, no, it's not for money. I love him. Like you, okay. Yeah, that's right. All right. All right, you got to get back back thank you oh no time and uh, <laughs> just just uh, type in uh, ports ports of call buffet hackensack and uh, it should port be port of call no s port of call port of call, port of call. Yeah. okay you want to know the story behind it well, yeah port sure. of call restaurant right 
when, it, when Will, Lynn, was a little boy, he traveled from sea to sea with like his dad and they took him all around the world to try all these different things. So when he got older, he took everything that he liked from all different ports and made it as one. And America was like his favorite one. So he has friends and he has... Now who was this? Will Lynn. Will Lynn? Yeah, there's three more of these places inside Florida too. Miami, there's it's one. Great place. Great place. You just gave me the figure. You're waving Probably. your hand? <laughs> I saw that on Seinfeld. Hey, what the George waitress. Hey, George George Costanza. Costanza. Can't stand you. George I love Costanza. Seinfeld. Can't stand. The waitress goes like this. Oh, I think we have some more of that. Uh, I'll, I'll check in the back. <laughs> yeah, she, she did one of those to me. He's like one of the best waiters. I taught him everything he knows. Well, I told him he was the best as soon as I walked in. I taught him everything. Are you crazy? I taught him everything. This is my lovely assistant. How are you teaching me? Are you no, crazy? you're my So assistant. Pinky trained you? Yes, of course. No, not at all. Because I'm mommy. I'm naturally I'm a good way. I asked her. I asked her if. Out of my face. I, <laughs> I asked her if people, girls with pink hair are pink all over. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway. Good story. Thank you. No problem, guys. Thank Take you. care. And if you ever need a singer or a songwriter. Let me know. Okay. Oh, we have a open mic coming up uh, November 1st at the Patterson uh, Historic Museum near the Great Falls, cool. starting at 6 p.m. Uh, me and my friend, the performer, we're, we're, we're holding the open mic uh, talent That's show. That's awesome. I'm going to go. Go. What do, yeah. I, what do I look it up? Where do I go? Well, Is just, uh, you get it's called, uh, yeah, yeah, just, yeah, it's Can't Can Create. Give you a number. What's your point? Right, um, hold on for a second. What do you mean you can't say? What do you think I'm gonna come get you? Come out over here. Everybody thinks so. Every man is a stalker. You know what? You know what it is. Like this girl's trying to help me. She's a lovely girl. She's trying to help me with my service because my service is slow as shit. I don't know what the hell happened. I switched service. Supposedly a faster plan. Like a, like a five, what is that? What kind of plan did I switch to? Five gigabyte, like what is that? Is that fast? Uh, it's not bad, it's good. It's usually four, I think. I think it's usually four gigabyte. switch me to a five gigabyte, whatever garbage that is. And now my phone's twice as slow. Instead it was supposed to be twice as fast. No, it should be, it should be much faster. Yeah. yeah. This, this girl's lovely though on the phone. Lovely girl. Southern California, but she's scared to say exactly where. <laughs> she can't, she can't, she says she can't provide the information. Yeah, you're scared. But anyway, <laughs> you got five gigabytes. <laughs> <laughs> James, James can't hold the straight face. You see how comical I am? See that, everyone? Huh? I was born with it, man. What five gigabytes. Five gigabytes for your cell phone uh, speed is pretty good, right? Gigs. He's got. Well, he, he, it depends on what you're gonna use it for. Yeah. You you get, don't want, if you're gonna take a lot of pictures, hold music, stuff like that, yeah. then you might need a little more. Right. Five gigs. So just hold. What the fuck music. is a gig? <laughs> it's a, a gig is I a thousand it's uh, megabytes. Right? I don't know. Or it could be like an acting gig or a, or, or a gig for a rock band or storage space. Look, how could there be an outage in the area I'm in all the time? An how outage? is that possible? Are you kidding me or what? How, what coincidence is that? Every area I'm in and every time I call, there's an outage in that area. Is that, is, you know, is that a coincidence or is someone just fucking with me? Huh? What is it? So last time I called, when there was an outage near Edgewater, I mean, they weren't lying to me. It was true. There was an out. Now there's an outage in the Hackensack area. I'm in, right? Yeah, for real, huh? You believe this camera? A uh, cameraman. Do you believe this? No, I what don't. should I do about this? Uh, switch what back. What should I do about this? Switch back to your original plan. What do you think? Switch back to your original plan. Switch back to the original plan, right? All right, ma'am, so how long is this outage gonna be? Three months? Four months? How old? How old? Let's... All right, so how long is this outage gonna be? Another month, two months? All right, I'm gonna call you back in two days. Let's see if the outage is still there in the other area I'm in. I'll be in Long Island. Let's see if there's an outage there too, all right, honey? 
No, you've been nothing but nothing. Thank you. Thank you. Fucking people, bro. Outage, inage, inage, outage. You can give, are you kidding me? So you're paying so more every money? Time, so, every time, so every time I call them and there's a problem with the speed, there's an outage. Every time I've called them, there was an outage in that area I was in. Is that coincidence or is that true? It can't like, be a coincidence. There's an outage every time. You might as well go back to your original plan. You're paying more money for the... For the no, actually, the, it's less. It was less for more. It's less for oh, more. Less for more? Yeah, but I think they, they had some kind of, something's going on. Something's going on. I gotta go over there to where the, all, this, all this shit takes place. I just gotta start smacking heads into these keyboards or whatever they're doing over there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what all I'm right, saying? aside from, oh, all right. aside, let's get back to the yeah. uh, port of call buffet. All right, let me get happy uh, again. The critique. Now, this was two, two of us. We had uh, drinks. Actually, did you get any drinks? No. No, I, I had uh, I had the drinks, uh, coffees. Those are a little extra. That's you know next besides the buffet. The buffet was wonderful. I mean, you know, I can't even breathe right now. I ate I, I ate an equivalent to a little bear, small little bear, a little cub. I ate the equivalent to a little cub. So I ate, I ate a lot of meat. All right. So uh, did you? Would you eat a half a cub? What do you think? Much meat. I don't know. I, I ate a lot of sushi. I didn't have I didn't have a lot of meat per se. I had, I had a lot of. Uh, I, had well, the, I had the equivalent of like ten porgies. Yeah. All right. Now look. This is what we got. I, I had uh, some some skirt steak. All right. Beautiful. Now the price. Here's the price. Focus in on that. All the little details. You got to get them all. Beautiful. Beautiful. I go up. Atta boy. Let me tell you, man, this is the best value so far. Even the other buffet that's $7, you know what? Compared to this, not even, there's no comparison. In terms of overall quality, bang for the buck? Not even close. Overall quality, it's the best. This is the best by far. Unbelievable. You guys got to try this. The best of the best. This used to be called what? Greenfields? Churros Korea? Yeah. Oh, Green Grill. Green Grill? Green, Greenfield. Green, I think it's, yeah, Green Grill. Green Grill. Incredible. Incredible value. Unbelievable. You know? Beautiful stuff. Incredible value. I, I would say, in my, it's my experience, for the money, the best value so far in northern New Jersey. By far. So By far. far. We might find another one though that might be better than this. That's why I always say so far. Every time we're blown away by a place, establishment, I always say so far. So, I give it two thumbs up. Atta boy. Today was excellent. This guy took care of me. You know, he, he, uh, he, he, he enabled me to eat a small bear. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> So, uh, uh, hey, I'm gonna see. Actually, go do what you gotta do real quick. No, I'm trying to catch that uh, on foot. But you know what? I'm gonna give you a. There you go. We're so grateful. I'm gonna give you a $10 tip. Is that okay? Yeah? You sure? That's for you, buddy. All right? Thank you, guys. All right, man. Have a good one. Thank right. you. Nice to meet uh, you. Anytime, man. All right. We'll be back. Get me back on foot, man. Catch you guys make me a star, give me 35%. Okay. <laughs> catch you on the web. Yeah. Look me. It's yeah. not about star. Don't worry about it. Stars, remember, stars couldn't shine our shoes. <laughs> the, the stars are the guys who got thrown in garbage cans. All Trust right, me. All right. All right? Yeah, I don't want to be one of those guys. All right. All right, so this, this place has is, is got our uh, ultimate stamp of approval. Beautiful. And that, that was our waiter, uh, Domingo, uh, from Port of Call Buffet, up, Upscale Buffet, Hackensack, New Jersey. I believe this is Hackensack Avenue. All right. Uh, he deserved that tip. Yeah, he deserved the tip. Uh, this is uh, James P. Madonna and Mario Petrus from uh, Best Buffet Bargains and the Facebook group Everything is Food saying Bon Appetit. Not Bon Appetit, but Bon Appetit. This has been a Mega Life 21 production.